Jody, we're friends, right? Sure. Best friends? W well, uh... Um, do you want some candy? Uh, okay. What'd you want? Don't worry, I'll buy one of each. That's what friends are for. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know what to feel. Sadness for a little sister or anger at that horrible freeloader. How about both? <laughs> <laughs> trying to do here? Prove that Anna Issa has been brainwashed by Jody. Look, I'll throw another no, one. No, no, no. I, I believe you. How about you stop throwing things at innocent girls and we speak to Anna Issa when she's alone? <sighs> hey, Jody, you want me to carry your bag? Okay. <laughs> Ow! Hey, Anna Issa, you need to talk. What about? Dear Diary, today I made a wretched friend who takes advantage of me and deserves to have objects thrown at her face. Oh, oh, what was that for? That was for reading my diary. Oh. And that was for using my voice without permission. And that's for trying to throw things at my friend. And that's for worrying about me. You don't understand. She's not your friend. She's a parasite. First, she uses you to get stuff. Then when you think you guys are friends, she takes over your mind, attaches herself to your body, and before you know it, she's turned you into a fungus thingy so she can release her spores, contaminate more people, and destroy civilization as we know it. I stole that last part from a zombie video game. It's just, I don't want you to feel sad when you realize she's not a true friend. Look, for once I get to hang out with someone who gives me my own problems, rather than someone who makes me fix theirs. Who's that? Sounds awful. You! Please don't ruin this for me! Follow her! That'll be five bucks. I'll pay for me and my friend. No, 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 no. That chicken is so old I came before the egg. Come on, lunch is on me. Here, help yourself, Jody. I know how much you like free stuff. Hmm. Who made this? Oh, just me and Dad. So they're all the same, right? Of course. Great, then let's eat. Oh, wait, you don't want that one, Jody. I think Dad was running out of mayo by the time he made it. Here, have mine. It's got loads of mayo in it. Oh, you won't want that, then. It'll be soggy. Here, let's swap. I love mayo. What? No! You hate mayo, remember? What? Oh, oh yes, uh, I just remembered. I hate mayo. Oh, for dirt's sake! There, now it's fair for everyone. We'll just blend in with the crowd and then go straight for the cupcakes. Oh, hi, Mel! Hi. Always great to see you. Hey, Barbara! Mwah, mwah. Looking good. She had a lot of work done. Jeff, my man! <laughs> Sorry to hear you broke up with Karen. Karen! Love the dress. Call me. Where is everyone? I don't know. I prepared everything and no one came. Did you invite anyone? Of course not. I have no friends. Hmm. You know, you're really clever, but sometimes you're kind of an awkward sausage. You need friends to have a party. But the whole point of this party was to make friends. Hmm. Hey, how about we make one up for you? Like an imaginary friend. Okay. Come on, think hard. Come on, you two. Close your eyes and imagine it. <sighs> Shouldn't we be screaming? I was kind of waiting for you. Let's do it on three, two, one. <gasps> nah, I think the moment's passed. Why does he look like that? I guess because we imagined him all together. I didn't think he'd be so real. Can it speak? Hello? Did we really make you up? Uh, yeah. If we could imagine him into life, we could imagine anything! Yeah! yeah. We could imagine money and give it to the poor! We could imagine an extinct species and bring it back to life! We could imagine I never got caught by mom using her hair removal cream on my butt! Or we could imagine I never said that. <laughs> okay! Hi! Nice to meet you! High five! <sighs> right. Well, Anais looks like we found someone as socially awkward as you. Uh, why don't you guys try and be friends? 
good one. Come on, guys, make an effort. Make eye contact. Come on. Come on. I said eye contact with him. Yeah, I don't have to do. Now let's try a smile. Like this. Ah. make friends with a straight jacket. Let's move on to making small talk. Demonstration! Oh, hi. Oh, I love your hair. What's your secret? Metal pattern hair loss with a sprinkle of stress. So, who do you know here? Oh, I'm Anais's brother. Really? Me too. She's so weird looking, right? Yeah, she's like a garden gnome who got her head transplanted from an Easter Island statue. <laughs> <laughs> we both like that fun at the detriment of others. We should totally be friends. All right, your turn. Uh... Come on, say something. I like hair. Uh, here. Have some. <laughs> oh, uh, you have some hair, too. <clears throat> oh, uh, here. I'm pretty sure that's not how you make friends. Put it back on. Okay, you weirdos, just say hi and shake hands. Hello. Hi. Oh, man, I'm so sorry. No, no, wait! Don't worry. It's okay. <laughs> Stop it, Tickles! <laughs> it's hard to know how to feel about this. On the one hand, it's all, but on the other hand, it's... <laughs> it doesn't matter. I made a friend.